Hi guys, sorry about that, just sorting it out again. Um, let me know in the chat room now if the audio is okay. Uh, I've having to use a different software. I think the software has literally just gone crazy. So um, yeah, let me know in the chat room now if the audio is okay for you guys. Um, probably, it's probably lagging now behind, so it probably look like I'm gorming out. <laughs> so uh, yeah, sorry about earlier, but I'm back and we're back live so yeah as i was saying earlier before it all started echoing and going crazy um so last time we did some spirit box sessions with the psb 11 spirit box um and we got some really interesting things um a lot of you got involved in the chat room and stuff which was really good and a lot of you actually started commenting and stuff when the video actually went live on the YouTube channel, let me know your sort of things that you'd heard and stuff. Um, also live as well in the chat room when I was actually doing the spirit box, which was really good. So if you can all get involved again and start uh, commenting in the live chat and stuff, if you do hear things on the spirit box, that would be amazing. Um, one of the other things I was going to discuss first uh, before sort of we got into the spirit box sessions and seeing who we can contact. Like last time we got the Eddie who supposedly followed me from a location recently, which is a bit creepy to know that he's sort of watching around here. So today I'm doing the live show in my living room, which is probably the main room in the house where I get sort of really good, uh, clear uh, class A EVPs. Um, so I thought, yeah, we'll have a change. We'll do it down here for this week. Every single week now on this channel, I'll be doing live shows for you guys. So I hope you can all join in and enjoy them and get involved and stuff. Um, if you can now, share this link to people who you think will like watching it. Give it a like. Uh, subscribe to the channel as well if you haven't done that yet. And uh, we shall get on with the show. So for the first sort of five-ish minutes before we do the Spirit Box session, I wanted to like discuss haunted dolls that people say are supposed to be haunted by demons, uh, negative entities or whatever you think possessed them. Um, I'm a bit like, I don't know, two minds about the things. I've never come into contact with anything like that. Um, I know a lot of paranormal investigators sort of go out of the way to purchase these dolls and they use them on investigations and stuff to try and enhance paranormal activity. And a lot of them say that they work, um, me myself i really not my thing going on the internet and buying a doll that's supposed to be haunted by a demon um so yeah i don't think i'll be trying that anytime soon um so what do you guys think about haunted dolls would you take one on an investigation or would you buy one or do you own one now um let me know in the live chat um if you have a haunted doll or anything like that um and what you think about them um so yeah, I would like to maybe try one on an investigation, see if it actually does anything. Um, I just don't really see a demon possessing a doll. It's I don't know. It just doesn't seem realistic to me. Um, I've never come into contact with that sort of thing. So I'm not saying it's 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 fake and it's not real and it's made up. Um, Obviously, you've got things like the Annabelle doll that's had movies made about it, and it's now in a museum in America owned by John Zaffis, which is an investigator in the in the US, uh, who many of you probably know from um, Haunted Collector TV show. Um, so yeah, um, also one actually, whilst I'm talking, I shall say, um, last time we did a live show, people were saying they had problems with. Uh, the live chat room. You have to be signed into a YouTube account to be able to um, actually join in on the live chat. So please, if you if you want to join in, sign into YouTube and then chat at the side. Um, when we actually do the spirit box sessions as well um, shortly, um, again, keep chatting at the side and let me know um, what you're hearing and if you've heard anything that I haven't said that I've heard in the video. Um, so yeah, um, again, let me know guys in the chat room if you would take a haunted doll on an investigation. Let's write to you guys on the chat room. So um, yeah, what I want to actually try and do is because we got that 
guy called Eddie, um, whatever his name was. I think it was Eddie. Um, I'm going to try and get him again on the spirit box. Now, according to him last time, he said that he's with me all the time and he followed me from a location that I've investigated with haunted finders. So if he's here, then surely you can talk again on this. Um, before I actually start, I had a really weird experience with John um, when we were actually filming this weekend with the spirit box. Uh, we actually had a spirit affect the spirit box, which I've never had happen before. And they actually drained the whole spirit box. Literally, I asked them to turn it off and you'll see it in the new episode this Friday. I asked them to turn the spirit box off and they did. They literally drained it and turned it off, which was really weird. But the strange thing is, I said to John at the time, uh, maybe they've just literally drained all the battery power, but I've turned this on as soon as I got home from the investigation, it started straight up. Still got the same battery in now, still working perfectly fine. Got loads of power, um, just flipping creepy. So, yeah. Again, we heard quite a lot. Um, I don't know if uh, any of you are watching who watched the other day. We heard quite a lot of like female voices. And some of you said that you heard a child as well talking through the spirit box. So maybe we could come into contact with some of them. Who knows? So, um, sorry, guys, I'm just reading some of your comments. Tell you now that Doll Island scares the crap out of me. I hate dolls anyway. I hate mannequins or anything like that. Um, the actual thumbnail that I was going to put up on this video, which was on the earlier one, scared the crap out of me when I was finding it. So, yeah. So, what I'm going to do is turn this spirit box on now, guys. So, for all of you that are watching now, um, if you want to get involved in the live chat, if you hear anything that I don't say I hear on this, at the time, just keep writing in there. Um, yeah. Yeah, we will try and contact the Eddie as well that you mentioned in the live chat. Um, so, yeah, let's see what we get. I'm going to start the spirit box on a 100 millisecond sweep. Um, I'm going to scan it on both of the channels. Um, whoever's not familiar with the PSB11 spirit box, I'm not sure if you can see it now. Um, it has two channels, basically two SB7 spirit boxes in one device that's been modified and enhanced. Um, it doesn't tend to get radio signal through on the SB11, which is really good as well. Uh, so basically, I'm going to sweep both stations at the same time. I'm going to sweep one of them in reverse and one of them forwards, and both at 100 milliseconds. And then I'm going to go up to 150 milliseconds because a lot of you are saying in the live chat last week that you wanted me to do it um, for 150 milliseconds because they yeah, apparently they can be heard more through that sweep. So we'll do that as well. But first, we shall start on 100 milliseconds. So let's do this. Also, got a new camera. Hope the quality is better for you as well, guys. Okay, let's do this then. 100 milliseconds. I think that's loud enough. It's deafening. Doll finders. I don't think so. <laughs> right. If there's any spirits that were here the other day when we did these live shows, Eddie or any of the female spirits or children, can you come forward now and come and say hello to me, please? Whoa, that was a hello. You guys must have heard that. Very clear. Thank you. Eddie, is that you? It sounded like a male. I think I just said Tom. Eddie, can you answer yes or no? Is this you trying to communicate with us? Oh my God, it just said yeah. Oh my god, I've seriously got goosebumps right now. 
this is what I mean in this room. They literally answer all the time. If there's, if there's a female spirit in here with Eddie, can you come and say hello in your voice, please? If there's a female here, please try and say hello. Oh, that was hello, and there's literally a shadow just gone past me in the room. Oh my, I've seriously got goosebumps now. A shadow's just flew over there after that woman said hello. Holy crap. Is that you? If that was a lady, can you say yes? Come on, you can do it. Come and talk to me. What the? Just heard like a scream before I took my hand off. Come on, talk to me. Come on, don't be afraid. If any of you guys want to, me to ask any questions on the spirit box, write it in the chat room and then I'll sort of relay it on the live video. Who's here with me now? Which spirits? I know you're here. I can feel you. Literally, someone just touched my head. What the hell? What the hell? Um, Eddie, if you're here, can you say your first name, please? Can you say it, Eddie? What did that say? Eddie, is that you? Say your first name. Say Eddie if it's you. What? What? There's a heartbeat. Heartbeat. What the? They're doing a heartbeat through the spirit box. If that's you, if that's you, stop the heartbeat. What the? What the hell? Stop the heartbeat, please. If it's you doing the heartbeat sound, stop it and say your first name for me. I need to know who you are. It stopped! It stopped! <laughs> Holy shit, someone just gone past me. Eddie, say your first name, or the person who did the heartbeat, say your first name clearly, please. <laughs> what the hell? we we'll put it up to 150 milliseconds like you guys asked last, last week. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> literally. Something's messing with the spirit box, guys. Like, what the hell? I think they're draining the battery. That is weird. Literally, I'll be I'll be back in literally five seconds to get a new battery.
going to spirit box. Shadows left in the living room. Holy crap, I'm back. Literally, some, there has been shadows like walking around me here and then something's literally just drained the spirit box. What the hell's going off tonight? It's like they know we're going to communicate with them. Weird. If you're still there, hold on, I'm just changing the battery because you've drained it. What? Batteries in these spirit SB11s last for ages. They use 9 volt batteries. So this is unusual. Let's get back to it. Yeah, I'm sweeping at 150 now, guys. Read some of your comments. That heartbeat was freaky. I'll ask for the heartbeat again as well. Hopefully it can do it. Because that was weird. I've never had that before, ever. If you're still here with me, if you literally just drain the battery on the spirit box, or if you did the heartbeat sound, can you come and talk to me, tell me your name, or do the heartbeat sound again? Oh my god, I'm sure it just says hello. That was a lady. What's your first name, please? Tell me your first name. Turn the volume up. Say hello, please. I wish I could get the lucky numbers. <laughs> I've done that already. Come and say hello if you're still here. I can feel you around me. Come on. You were just here. You just did a heartbeat sound on this spirit box. And you were talking loads. Come and talk again, please. If you're still here, come close now. Don't be afraid and come and say hello to us. Someone's asked, are you attached to this house? Yes or no? Are you attached to the house? Putting the sweet bite, uh, sweet rate back to 100 because it seems to be getting more voices then. Are you still here? The heartbeat, the heartbeat's back. Oh. That is amazing. That is just ruled out coincidence. New fresh battery. If that's you, say hello. 
¡No te ¡No te Come and say hello. If you're still here with me, I know you're affecting the spirit box. Come and tell me if you're attached to this house or if you're attached to me. Come and say hello. Oh my days, guys. You're not even going to believe this. I've just put a fresh, brand new battery in out of the pack. And it's literally, they've drained the spirit box again. Listen. What is that? They drain the power out of two batteries. What the? That is weird. That is so weird. Can you tell me why you're here with me? Right. Guys, <laughs> they've literally just drained two brand new batteries. Like, what the hell? They've took all the energy out of this twice. So, <laughs> I'm going to just go and grab my SB7 spirit box. Let's see if they do the same thing to that one. Let's go. A few seconds, guys. Is it? Oh, literally, guys. <laughs> I've just gone to get the uh, SB7 spirit box, and my partner's upstairs, and my little boy's watching a DVD in his bedroom, and the DVD I was watching has just ejected out of the DVD player and threw onto the floor. At the same time that this was just drained. Now, is that a coincidence or is something going off here? I'm going to turn on the SB7 spirit box now. I'm telling you, this, this is creeping me out. This is so much better than the last live show. They're like literally getting better and better by the day. Right. I'm going to put the SB7 on. Full battery. Is there anybody here still? Can you say hello? If you're draining the spirit box. In fact, why are you here? No way, it just told me to F off. What? Why are you in my house? Why are you in my house?
Did you guys hear that woman's voice? I don't know what she said. I couldn't make it out. I just said Eddie. Oh my god, I just seen something over there. What the hell? What is this? <laughs> Eddie, if that's you, can you tell me why you're in my house, please? What? That was the same voice. Eddie, why are you in my house? I need to know why you're here. If you like talking to me, if you truly did follow me from a location that I investigated, say yes. That was a yes. <coughs> Eddie, do you know my name? If you do, say it now, please. Say my name if you know me. That just said, I know you. Holy crap. <laughs> it just shouted Tom. Definitely just shouted Tom. If you guys want me to say anything else, write it in the chat room now and I'll ask on the spirit box. You said hello, a woman's voice. Come and say hello to the people in the chat room. <laughs> it just said no. Oh my god. I guess it didn't want to say hello to you guys. Um, did you live in this house? No, it said, didn't live in the house. Okay. Okay, are you negative? Yes or no? Are you? Do you, can you see the people in the chat room? I want you to come through on this device here and say one of their names. It just said Kieran. What the hell? I'm sure Kieran's just asked that question as well. Oh my days. That was amazing. What? If you like um, communicating, if you enjoy doing this, say yes. Are you happy? Are you happy where you are? Yes or no? <laughs> Something just said, hey. Are you happy? I want you to tell me yes or no. Are you happy? What the? That just said, Tom, answer me. Tell me then, speak to me. No. <laughs> oh my god. This is funny.
it seems like there's quite a few people around. Um, are any of you relatives, yes or no? Can you tell me if any of your relatives Whoa, a female's come through and says, I am. Did you hear that? Can you say companion? Say companion. Don't like you can say that. There's definitely multiple voices, guys. Like, it's strange. I did say, honestly, that this room is the most active in the house. Right. Well, there didn't seem to be much more coming through on there. It literally had like a big surge of voices and then it started to slow down again. So I guess they're running out of energy, wherever you are. So yeah, um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this live show again. Thanks everyone for getting involved on the chat room. Um, again, loads of stuff was said and I know a lot of you have obviously been worrying because of it being like a negative spirit or whatever. Um, but I'm planning on sort of cleansing the house uh, of negative energies and stuff. Um, and to be honest, I'm used to having spirits around me. Um, if any of you have heard my latest radio show that I did, uh, which I post up on Twitter and stuff, uh, linked to, um, basically I grew up with spirits around me, seeing them, hearing them, waking me up in the night. Um, it's a regular thing that's been around me and literally from the age of 16 when I was in year 11 at school in the UK, um, I used to do, sort of, I could turn on EVP recorder and literally the first thing they'd say is hello Tom. That was at the age of 16 which then is when I first started my investigations at the age of 16 and literally I could turn on any device like the spirit box, um, EVPs, anything, and I'll get communication straight away. And it's it's weird because it's like they swarm to me and you get loads of spirits around and stuff. Um, it's really, really strange, but uh, I enjoy it at the same time. Uh, it's good for my investigations as well because I always seem to get stuff happen because um, obviously they're attracted to me for some reason. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Um, Thanks for commenting. If you're watching this now, not live, uh, leave a comment down below. Tell us what you thought. If you heard anything, write it in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'll be doing these live shows every single week. And if they do get quite popular, I'll begin to do two a week. And I'll start to do more things as well. I want to try and figure out how to do like live shows and stuff. Um, not live shows, what am I talking about? Live ghost hunts. So when I actually go on an investigation, I can do a live show or a live broadcast whilst we're on location, which will be really cool. So um, hopefully you guys can watch some of those soon as well. So thanks again, guys, for watching. Um, and that's it for now. See you next week for another one.
Goodbye. Peace.